Let me tell you something. I said, it is so easy to be an armchair quarterback when you're not in the game, when you haven't been crushed for anything. It is easy to weaponize scripture, but God is about the Bible, not your bias. So I'll go about my father's business and you can keep searching for female ministers who are sharing their ministry and then search under the comments to attack and accuse because that's what Pharisees do. Blessings. Bye now. And that was it. It was done. It did end it. I'm not going to lie. It ended it right then and there. The Lord's like, I'm done with it. I'm done with it. So he said, these are the false I ideologies that I am like, I'm not tolerating it anymore. It's been happening. The Lord said for so long now, my daughters are rising up. The Esthers are rising up. The Debras are rising up. The Jael's are rising up. The Junias are rising up. And we will not be stopped because there is a harvest and we need all workers, all workers of the harvest. And the Lord wants you to know, especially if you are watching and you are a woman, the Lord wants you to know that you do have a voice and you do have a call and you will cut the words of the Pharisees with the spirit of truth as your weapon. Now, when I say cut the words, I don't mean you being cutting and mean. No, I mean you speaking the truth. Enough is enough is enough. The true bride is rising up and they are not playing around. We have a hammer, we have a tent peg, and we are not afraid to use it.